Hello everybody and welcome to my channel. My name is Jennifer Moran. I am a professional psychic and I'm here to give you guys a tarot card reading for your month of April forecast for your uh, career if you are self-employed. Now if you are employed with somebody, I have that in the cards as well as your love for singles, for couples, and just your regular financial overview. Whatever you need this month, I got you covered. April is a fun month because it's also my birthday because I'm an Aries, so happy birthday to me. Um, and let's see what's going on with your career. All my self-employed peeps like myself, I'm self-employed as well. All right, you guys, let's decorate these cards with some pretty stones just to help you guys out. This is a beautiful amethyst pendulum, deck number one. This is a gorgeous Black Tourmaline Pendulum, deck number two. This is a beautiful oh, white clear quartz crystal, deck number three. So what I want you guys to do is just think about your career, your business, I should say. Think about your business and any questions you have pertaining to it. And then I want you to just relax and go with the first stone that you feel the most connection toward. The one that you feel the most drawn to. Don't second guess yourself. Everything is going to be time stamped so that you can go directly to your particular reading and you don't have to watch the whole thing. Though if you do watch the whole thing, I greatly appreciate it because it helps out my channel. So <laughs> let us start with deck number one. This is deck number one, deck number two, deck number three. Okay, dokie. Deck number one with this beautiful amethyst pendulum. Do you guys want me to do pendulum reading videos? If you do, let me know. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm a little hyper today. I don't know what's wrong with me. <laughs> Let's see what's going on. Okay. Oh, okay. Here's the deal. Your business is going to pop. Now, that's a good thing, in case you didn't know. Your business is going to pop like nobody's business. Um, you're really heading for, like, April is going to be a really good month for you. May and June, July is going to continue to be good. All of the work, all of the funneling, all of the whatever you want to call it, all of the marketing and whatever technical term you use to draw business to you is finally going to start to come. I don't know if your seasons are changing and that makes a difference. Hello, truck. Go deliver your potato chips. Um, I don't know what they're delivering. I just like to think it's potato chips. Anyway, um, basically, this is a good month for you. I feel like things are going to start to pop. You're going to start to get, like, the everything that you've been doing is, has been culminating. And I feel like you're going to finally start to feel like, oh, my God, this is actually working. Like, the, I'm not crazy. This is a good idea. I finally realized, like, I'm doing the right thing. Everybody who said this wasn't going to work out is going to feel stupid because I'm doing great. That's... <laughs> little dramatic thing I just did, but that's kind of what I'm feeling is going on for you right now. So I feel like this is going to be a very good month for your business and you're going to start to feel more legitimate, more, more purposeful, more excited. And this is going to be really good. Just, you know, go slow. The growth is really good, but just, you know, take it, take it as it comes. Don't push yourself and don't like bite off more than you can chew, but it's a very good thing. Very good thing. I'm excited for you. Next is deck number two, Mr. Black Tourmaline. In case you guys didn't know, Black Tourmaline is really good for removing negative energy and protection. So if you just want that kind of protection in the workplace or any other place, get yourself a little Black Tourmaline little thing like this. Keep it in your pocket and it will keep you from, you know, dealing with all everybody else's crazy little energy. Just a little pro tip. Pro tip from, from me to you. All right, let's see what's going on with you, deck number two. Mm. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Be excited. Uh, I feel like... I feel like your business is tra changing and transforming. Um, and this has been hard because I feel like you are somebody who does not like to change and transform. You are a caterpillar who likes being a caterpillar and you do not have any interest in being a butterfly. You think caterpillars are just awesome. And, you know, that's not necessarily a bad thing, but I feel like, um, I feel like 
changes are coming. I want you to prepare yourself for them. It's not a bad thing because I do feel like your business is is looking very healthy, like healthy, strong. This is a business that has been around for a long time. This is not something new that you're just starting right now. This is something that's well established. But I, I feel like it's going to, I feel like it's going to get better. But I do think you need to kind of, how can I say this? You do need to prepare somewhat for changes that are coming. And I'm going to give you an example. It's like when Blockbuster was around and they were like the big thing and Netflix wanted to have Blockbuster buy them and Blockbuster was like, whatever, we're Blockbuster, we don't need you. And then lo and behold, Netflix is like the thing now and Blockbusters are antiquated. And it was because Blockbuster didn't have the foresight to see that they needed to adapt to certain technologies in order to keep themselves a thriving business, blah, blah, blah. So I, that's kind of the lesson for you is that Think about maybe where your business might could use a little bit of upgrading and, and make those changes and you will see like huge rewards. Um, and just be open to it. I feel like this is something that somebody, not somebody, so this is something that you've already been kind of instinctually feeling yourself but have been fighting. <laughs> so maybe it's time to give that a second look. But I do feel your business is very strong and I just want it to continue to be strong and healthy. Deck number three with this beautiful quartz crystal. This is just such a pretty stone. Oh my God, I love crystals. All right, guys, this is deck number three. Let's see what's going on with deck number three. Okay, the first thing that I'm feeling, honestly, is that you're selling your business. <laughs> I feel like you're going to be making a big change. I see a lot of transformation and change, and I feel like you're going to be selling your business. It could be that you're partnering up with somebody, but I don't know. I, I feel you're going to sell. I just get the sense of you you got your business to a certain point. You're very proud of yourself for getting it to that point. You're, you're feeling good about that, but now you're like ready to move on, move and groove in a new direction. Maybe you're heading toward retirement. That's awesome if that's the case, but I do, I just see you kind of moving out of, away from your 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 business and wanting a different lifestyle and that's going to happen for you like that that all of the universe is going to make sure that that happens for you because i do see you making the change and i feel it's going to be very you know good for you it's like follow your instincts you're you're on the right trail and i do feel like that change that change is going to happen for you but yeah i i really see you leaving making the decision to kind of move on and 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 start a new kind of chapter in life it's a hard thing to do but I do feel that you're doing the right thing I don't feel you're gonna have any regrets I feel like it's a, a good move this is this is a big change but it's a it's a good change it's a positive change I'm excited for you it's 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 guys as a reader it's like I feel like this change is so big I feel almost a little overwhelmed reading it because I, I like to read where I talk to the person like that's how I do most of my readings I, I have a conversation with the person and I can hear their voice and I can connect with their energy and it's a little hard for me to see this kind of a big transformation and not have a person to like look them in the eye or listen to their voice and be able to have like a dialogue with them about all the details and I'm just like I want to be able to talk about all the different details but um, either way it's a very good thing I feel like, you know, your your instincts have always led you in the right direction. They'll continue to lead you in the right direction. Um, you're feeling torn about the idea. People may try to tell you to not to do it, but you have to listen to yourself. You always have, and it's always helped you. So you're, you're good. You're good. I'm excited. It's a good thing. Happy retirement. <laughs> um, I say retirement, but it's just retiring from your business. You could be starting something new, or you could be you know going somewhere else it's not I'm, I'm saying retirement I mean maybe you're retiring that could be but either way I'm excited for you so guys that has been the monthly forecast for self-employed people um I hope that you guys enjoyed this video if you did please give me a thumbs up comment below and let me know what you think I love making these videos for you guys and I love even more hearing your opinions if you like my video please give me a thumbs up it helps out my channel a ton like I always say I'm trying to get to a thousand subscribers I'm at like 340 something right now so we're, we're getting there little by little so I really appreciate all of the love and support you guys are absolutely the best i love doing these readings for you i will see you guys in the next video and i hope you have a marvelous month take care 
Actually, I shouldn't have said month because I'm going to be back like next week. I hope you have a marvelous weekend. <laughs>